Multi-sensory teaching, let's talk about it. Multi-sensory teaching is teaching using multiple senses. So your sight, your taste, your smell, your hearing, and your touch. However, there are four primary learning pathways to the brain, visual, auditory, tactile, and kinesthetic. A true multi-sensory lesson will include all four of these learning pathways. Multisensory learning is particularly helpful for kids with learning and attention issues. However, it can really benefit all students. The more senses you involve, the more likely your students are to retain and recall the information. What's great about using Orton Gillingham is that the method incorporates multi-sensory instruction throughout each lesson. So for example, when our students are writing sounds in the sand tray, they are using a variety of senses. Or how about pounding and finger tapping for dictation? If our word is mat, they pound the syllable first and go mat, and then isolate each sound with their fingers going m, a, before they even write the word. Also, what about red words, right? Those non-phonetic words that we really have to memorize, we load them into our brain and we arm tap them. Again, incorporating all kinds of various senses to make sure the material is locked in. Last but not least, remember to have fun with your students using multi-sensory teaching. I promise you they're really going to love it.